Hey everyone, I'm joined by Roy Taylor from AMD who previously threatened to cut my hair. I did. Uh, that's right. Where at, are those scissors? <laughs> yeah, we were at a GDC, right? Uh, we were, we were at GDC, yes. Before getting into that, all of this Computex coverage is brought to you by MSI's new X99 motherboards ready for Broadwell E, including the X99A Gaming Pro Carbon. So today we have a, it's sort of less AMD side, more just gaming side in general. Mm -hmm. uh, Roy Taylor is a pretty big fan of Battlefield. I am. You talked about it in the previous video. What's, so let's, let's do a Roy Reviews Battlefield. What's the, the <laughs> first one you played? What's the one you played the most? Okay, the very first one I played was uh, 1942, <laughs> which I really, really enjoyed. Uh, I thought it was just terrific. And I've uh, been playing them ever since. Uh, one of my favorites was Battlefield Vietnam. The soundtrack was awesome, and I just thought they really, they really recreated the jungle stuff. Right. And then uh, fighting for the cities, I just thought it was really great. And then, so uh, 1942, I only played a little bit. Could, could you pipe your own music into that game through the helicopters and stuff? Yeah, I can't remember. Well, it's 1942, so there weren't any helicopters. Um, right, actually, yeah. what mostly sticks in my mind was they had this kind of like, I don't know, it's a bug or kind of feature thing where you could actually, if you were as a soldier, you could jump on the wing oh, yeah, <laughs> of, yeah. of, of, of yeah. a plane. And you could actually fly along from the wing of the plane, which is kind of funny. Yeah. So uh, Battlefield 4 you've played the I most, have. right? Over 1,000 hours, yeah. What's your rank? Um, 132 right now. Actually, no, I think 134. So if there are any uh, NVIDIA fans out there who want to yes. hunt you down, what, yes. what, what name should they look up? So um, I'm Leonidu, <laughs> L-E-O-N-I-D-O-O. -O. Um, and in fact, actually, uh, I was talking uh, the presentation just now. Uh, there's some great, great fans at PC Per. So, uh, so Ryan Shrout, the editor, got me together with their fans and they did a Kilroy competition. Oh, yeah. <laughs> In fact, we did three Kilroy competitions. They were, they were really, really fun, actually. Um, but I wasn't so easy to kill. So, uh, <laughs> yeah, I did pretty well. A thousand hours, I believe that. Mm -hmm. Yeah. yeah. Uh, what about Battlefield 1? What are your thoughts on that one? Yeah, that's, uh, that's what prompted this video. Yeah. I am so excited about Battlefield 1. Um, being in World War 1, I'm a big history buff anyway, and the chance to fly, you know, a Fokker Wolf, and the chance <laughs> to say that on camera right. is really <laughs> awesome. Um, and also... We might, um, we might have to censor that, I'm not sure. Yeah, oh, I said it. I think I said it correctly. It's okay. Um, but you've got, you got biplanes, you've got artillery pieces, um, you've got World War 1 tanks. Um, you can, it just, it, it looks freaking awesome. <laughs> and what about on the AMD side? Is there anything we can talk about new coming up? Talk about today for AMD. Um, I can say that we will continue our long association and partnership with Electronic Arts and DICE. Um, and uh, AMD fans can expect to have a fantastic experience playing Battlefield 1. So as always, links in the description below. Follow us for Computex coverage. I believe AMD has a presence at Computex as well. We do have a presence at Computex. So we'll be talking a little bit more about Polaris a new GPU family, and all the great things that it can do. Very cool. So as always, more information on that as it rolls out. Thanks for watching. We'll see you all next time. Thanks. Thanks, guys. <laughs> all right. See you. And he still didn't cut his hair.